Gabriel Preciado tells us more about their new action plan. Southside business owner Alma Flores says she's witnessed speeding, drunk driving, and accidents on Cinco de Mayo. We all think about people's safety. Community leaders gathered Thursday to address this ongoing problem. But it really is my belief that if we have a county-sponsored Cinco de Mayo event here every year, we will be able to control it better. We will be able to uh, move people out of the park when it's time to go. During this year's Cinco de Mayo celebrations, a Milwaukee police officer was shot and an ice cream vendor's cart was knocked over by a group of people. That has caused tension in the community. We must continue to build and not allow these incidents and situations um, to cause friction or breakdown between us. Milwaukee County Supervisor Juan Miguel Martinez says they are working on city and county legislation to protect street vendors, as well as provide a space like Mitchell Park to hold Cinco de Mayo festivities. Having more events and making the parks more active is what's going to prevent things like this, because we have people that are going to be, we have people that are going to be using the parks. The efforts are aimed to help keep the community safe and united. We are all working here together in this city. We are all in these neighborhoods and we all work together in order to make things better and to make things happen. In Milwaukee, Abril Preciado, Fox 6 News. They also announced today a phone number for street vendors to report any incidents.